Last show of the week, ladies and gentlemen. It is Collider Live. Welcome back, everybody. Full show here today, and the All-Stars have joined us as we are sitting at the table talking about things for an hour, recapping the, the crazy week that was and some other crazy stories that have happened just, just today. Joining me back on the table, hello, Dorina. How are you? I'm good, Christian. How are you? I'm, I'm going to try to be nice to you today. Oh, I appreciate that. It's nice. After your wonderful tweet that you put out last night and how you were just in, encouraging the, the audience to give you more yes. to bust my balls. <laughs> yeah, I was Thank just you. joking. I know. Um, and joining us also, hello, Mark Ellis. Hey, hey, hey. How you doing? How's everybody doing? You weren't supposed to be here today, just like clerks. Unannounced visit. I like it. You and I shot a review <laughs> 10 minutes yeah. ago, and I decided I'd hang out for a little no, bit. No, you didn't. I, I made you come in. I was like, come uh, in. Dorina kind of prodded yeah. me. Well, I think you're the only person, though, that Ellis is the only one, if we're doing a full show, and he goes... Hey, I want to be on the show today. He's the only one I don't think I would ever say no, not today. Right. Aww, I've said, thank you. I, it's, it's it's not it's not to be nice. It's just it's just a better show. I'm I'm just that good. It, we it, it's, it's a so stupid thing. So it's a thing. selfish it, thing. It's yeah. It's, it's a, so it's, a, it's, a it's a stupid thing that we have. I'm just that talented, yeah. and uh, yeah. I'm I'm pleased to announce that wow. I am not the. It, there's going to be a competition on the show today. What is that? And that competition is who is going to get less inside references. Right. Is it going to be me, or or is it going to be the gentleman to my immediate right, Which Mr. Is Brett Sheridan, the, the skinny Brett Sheridan? Hey, Thanks to see you, skinny Brett. Yeah, yeah. Still will, dying. Will, will, will fat Brett join us again? No, no. I hope not. Okay. Well, I don't know. I'm going to Mardi Gras next week. So oh. We'll so see. maybe when I dine on nothing but king cake, yeah, they have good food. <laughs> oh man, yeah. this yeah. kind of yeah. jealous. Very low key. He's got the family, and you think, oh no, Brett just stays there. Yeah. He's a nice homebody. Guy goes to Vegas. Oh yeah, he goes to New Orleans. Yeah. Brett has some. He does some stuff. We're yeah. taking the kids to Mardi Gras this year. Oh, oh no, yeah, yeah. You can't enjoy so, Mardi Gras with the kids. Oh no, it's actually there's 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 a misconception about Mardi Gras. I've gone Jack. three times. There's no misconception. Well, no, you're like Bourbon Street in it. <laughs> yeah. There's there's That's parades around did. the neighborhoods oh. during the day that are very family. Mardi I've where? done that. You're yeah. right. Yeah. yeah. Where? Uh, Mart- like here or where? No, no in New Orleans. Oh, you're, yeah. oh yeah. really? Yeah. yeah. So it's not just year, boobs. And, and he got like hammered. No. And because okay. and, it was just him, and he and he was like passed down on couches, taking naps, staying up all night, drinking beer, right? Yeah, listen. that was the year before I did that, and then my wife said, "I'm coming with you this time." Right. <laughs> well, I could. I mean, listen, I would not be able to do Mardi Gras now, but it was my favorite thing in the world when I was a 21 year old kid. I, I mean, I, I went three times yeah. in college. I it's loved basically it. a bunch of parades. I mean, it's parades and well, throwing stuff, and it, like the the Bourbon families. Street thing. I you stay away from that, you know. It's, well, yes, I did not stay away. From no, that's no seems way. like too much of a to do for me. I. I I've never been Today. to New Orleans. Me either. I want to uh, go. I, I, I've been to New Orleans once. I, I went to New Orleans. Me and uh, Eliza Selesinger were doing a show there. And we, we were doing like a college tour around the southeast. And then we ended up, last show was a theater in New Orleans. And so we get there and we're walking around. We have one day and I got to catch a flight to Columbus, yeah, Ohio yeah, early. So it, yeah. I walked around for three hours. We got beignets at the famous place. And then I got a beer and we walked around Bourbon Street for yeah. a little bit. Walked into one store and we got we got we had a curse placed on us. Uh oh. Mm. Because for Eliza what? asked us there, there was a like that, that why you like the Eagles? <laughs> 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 you are cursed to listen to witchy woman. <laughs> um so we walk into the store and, and there's there's a cute dog there mm-hmm. and it's a dachshund kinda like Eliza's dog Blanche. And right. so Eliza asked the store owner, like, is it is that that it looks the half dachshund? And the store owner's like, It's a full dachshund. <laughs> and then she she stares at us Whoa. for like five seconds, and then she just goes to the back of the store. And we that don't know where it. she disappeared to. And we're like, what the fuck just mm-hmm. happened? Yeah. So we go to the next store, and we're like, we just had the weirdest experience. The nicest person there, she's like, you know what? This sounds like I need to burn some sage around y'all. So we're just standing in the middle of this next, it's like a candle store. She lights sage and just walks around us with sage. And so we were cursed for about 10 minutes. I almost grew a tail, but then I was purified at the last second. Good for you. I'm, I'm, I'm oh. proud of you. And New Orleans. I'm, glad, I'm glad that you're here. Brett. Welcome back. I know that, see, the difference is this, this is what we were talking about, Dorina, is that when Brett, Brett was very busy these last two weeks, normally he will listen to the shows that mm-hmm. he misses, so right. he's caught up on everything, he just wasn't able to do it. Mark never listens to the show, so, <laughs> so we don't, that's, so Brett will be, I mean, I, we'll you more. say, like, it's, it feels like you guys are criticizing my life now, when you're like, uh, how are you not that's, listening that's to Collider That's why I wanted Live? you on the show. <laughs> right. Just so I could just give so you shit <laughs> about liking the Eagles and not listening and not to Collider Live. I do enjoy the Eagles, and that is what you and I were talking about right. pre-show, is like, what, well, what do you 
listen to. And first of all, I'm I don't just listen to stuff constantly. No, I know. Like I just enjoy living. You like if that. I'm listening to a podcast, unless it's sports. Sometimes it's Collider Live. <laughs> That's a bull faced yeah, lie. It's sports, <laughs> but mostly it's music. So, right. do you listen to newer music, or you stick with your old? I do. The, the I, listen to, I, the, yeah. I listen to some new music. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like what? I am a big fan of uh, the Greta Van Fleet. Oh, yeah. yeah. See, yeah, we talked good. about them last week. Because he, they sound exactly like Led Zeppelin. Led Zeppelin. They look say, like a hobbit. Really good kind of, Led yeah. Zeppelin cover. Sounded like Zeppelin, though. I'm a fan yeah. of the uh, the Lizzo. Who? Lizzo. Album, start to finish, fantastic. Okay. Mm-hmm. Check out Lizzo. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, Mark Riley's sitting hi. in the back. Oh, there How you doing, hi. Oh, hi, everyone. You Happy are, Friday. Yeah, yeah you're going oh, to see... I, I didn't know you were here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I know. <laughs> I was very quiet. I was studying some uh, notes. Good. Are you going to see How You Train Your Dragon 3 tonight? I am going tonight. Opening night in the dome. Nice. Arc light. It's going to be really fun. Mm, I like okay, that. okay. Okay. I told him to bring tissues. Okay. okay. Yeah, I told oh, him. I'm, I'm yeah. jealous. I want to go see it. Yeah. You got eat. Not because anything happens in the movie no. No. necessarily, but just, just because of this is situations. a boy and dog story. Yeah. yeah. And, you yeah. know. Well, listen, you, you, I've been binging the movies. Yeah. We watched one and two, uh, like, last week and then finished two this week. Yeah. And uh, okay. binging, crying uh, a lot, well, having fun with it, yes. though. And that's, and that's all I'm, t- I'm not going to spoil anything for you. All, all I'm telling you is that towards the end of the movie, yeah. what you should do is just hold on to Julie and yeah. uh, memories will float in your head. And uh, yep. you know, and, we're, we're, and tell the person next you fuck off. This really is uh, <laughs> uh, it's, it's touching me. We're we're prepared. We we had a nice cry last night <laughs> together yeah, again. Get ready. Yeah, yeah, get ready. Like for one it. of those things. Hardest yeah. uh, hardest you've ever cried in a movie around the table. Mask. The Eric Stoltz movie. Really? I was mad at my really? mother. I was mad at my mother when she showed it to me because I was I didn't know what she was showing me and I was I was watching it. it was this in a theater? No, no, it was okay. at home in like VHS. Oh. I that was yeah, it came out way before. When but, was uh, this? Well, I must have been like, I don't know, seven or eight oh, okay. when I watched it. Mask was like eighty five. Yeah. But but when I saw but I saw a little wait. No, you're right. So yeah, it was eighty five. So I was, probably so I was like, like nine. I was like eight or nine. Yeah. So um but anyway, so I nine saw I saw it or eight. and whatever it was. <laughs> and I just remember watching it nine. and it see you got that it one. fucked me up. Yeah, because yeah. just and I was mad at my mother. Yeah. I was just, I was just yeah. like, why would you show this to me? It's an, like, it's it an attached. awfully sad movie. It is. Yeah. That's God. a bad one. Yeah. My life with Michael Keaton. Ooh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, dude, that what? was with that, Queen Latifah. That was wow. with Leaf. That was like our first like as new friends in college going to a movie together, and both of us like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I Queen. mean, he's also the greatest actor yeah. that's ever lived. So yeah, Latifah, you know. right? Yeah. He's fans. It's Michael, Michael Keaton, Keaton and Nicole Kidman, yep. and he's making all these little home videos for his kid because Michael Keaton's diagnosed with a terminal illness, right. and so he's making all these vi- like you know some of it's just like how to survive. Like here's how to make spaghetti in college. Here's how to make your bed. Here's what happens when you like a girl, and it's just all this stuff. Yeah. And God, that movie. Yeah. Woo, yeah. It's what a great you? movie. Which one to get you, Rudy? The one that made me cry the most is I as I probably told this story before. Oh, I know um, this. Dumbo. Nope. Oh. Nope. No, no, Dumbo will wreck me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, Rudy occasionally would get me when he gets into Notre Dame. Yeah. But the hardest I ever cried in a movie theater, I was seeing this movie by myself for Schmoes, was Night at the Museum 3. Are you serious? I am dead <laughs> serious. Uh, Shut up. Well, yeah, because at the, at the end of the movie, because yeah. Robin Williams had passed away prior uh, to the release. Okay, that makes and sense. And then Robin Williams, he plays Teddy Roosevelt yeah. in the series. And there's a scene, and I, th- I I would love to ask Sean Levy about this, like, because I, I, I swear... It's nice in the movie, but yeah. it, it, there's a scene at the end where, where Teddy Roosevelt's character is, he's saying, you know, goodbye, but will always be around, like, to Ben yeah. Stiller's night manager. And it's like Robin Williams is saying goodbye to all of us. Wow. Yeah. And I was a wreck. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Literally. Like, people could hear, they're like, is there a woman giving birth? <laughs> it was, yeah. Oh, it was bad. Yeah. What about you? Uh, last Suspiria? <laughs> <laughs> you guys, I'm not that fucked up. Yeah. Well. I did cry a little bit because it was so beautiful. Yeah. But uh, no, it was actually uh, last year in the theater. It was Won't You Be My Neighbor, the documentary. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I was a mess the entire time. Yeah, it's a good one. You, yeah, you, and, and that's why I'm still really pissed at the Oscars for, yeah, for multiple that, reasons. It should have been nominated yeah, yeah. for sure. But uh, you know the other one that we saw together back in the day that got me? Uh, you know yeah, wait, 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 wait. Let, let, let me come See, up remember the, the name. Uh, uh, this one got me. This oh, one got me bad. It's, it's the old people choir movie. Yeah, it is. The um, old people choir movie? Yeah, yeah nobody like knows. Oh, choir. Sister Act. No. <laughs> That's close. Close. Uh, damn it, I can't get it. It'll get you. It's called Young at Heart. Young at Heart! Oh, okay, okay, okay. It was, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was like the, the, these, uh, again, people who were pretty much on their way out. 
and they're they're going they're, they're like 70 80 and they're going they're, they're like they're like 90 maybe. 100 they're going around singing but right. they sing a Coldplay song the one Coldplay song they're singing yeah. and, and I like Coldplay fine but it was, they were but it was the way that it just touched you because you they were going through this whole entire right. thing about their lives and you're like oh my god these people are going to die soon <laughs> and I'm like no don't die I'm attached you and they're entertaining like other old folks homes yeah. and stuff and, and they go to like church groups and stuff and it's a documentary and the documentary took place over the span of three months so yeah. like at the start the choir is like 20 people by the end it's like so right, oh, right, they're, that's oh. right they're dropping they're just, like flying yeah, that's right just, that's, oh, that's what it was we're losing so many yeah, members that's, that's exactly so what it was happening I was like no not Tony I'm <laughs> yes. like, I, I, oh. I was like come on well, what about like classic movies? Because remember Riley, when we he's not paying attention. Yeah. Right? No, but no, uh, when we when this. I was on your podcast, we talked about ET. Riley has a podcast. Oh yeah. 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 <laughs> Riley has a podcast. You guys. I woke I up on the night, uh, right side of the bed it's today. It's better this than morning. this one. No, sir. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, ET. Yeah. yeah. Do you remember? I was going to say yeah. we, yeah, we so went to the up. re-release. Yeah. I went on. A, I was the third wheel on a date with with Brett and Lonnie, and I was on the side crying at the end of ET. Right. Every time I watch ET, Lonnie's like, "Who's?" the asshole you know. yeah. 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 I've seen it so many times and I can't, it's so messed up it when gets he me leaves. every time I'm looking who's in your shirt those monsters yeah oh I like it's that. a bunch of horror movies oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah I got Critters and Tremors and Freddy where'd you get that shirt on the internet well obviously oh, but wow. from where let's give somebody Vera a plug that's good. that's good Vera Meat yeah actually Clark Wolf told me about that I like yeah. that shirt it's a good shirt yeah. internet.com the um, internet you can buy a lot of things yeah. online Let's move on. Goods right. and services. There it is. There it is. Let's do it. Let's, oh. So the other thing, I, yesterday, the the Thrawn, the Thrawn guy is yeah. the best. Thrawn is awesome. He has Thrawn been to ma- K-Fi. Right? Yes, he has been making parody songs, but what he did is he took his chicken and beer song, mm-hmm. and he actually, he melded it with a... Uh, with uh, I can't remember the guy's name that he put it... Not, not the actual... This is the song, Cody, but did, you, did, they, did Riley send you the, other, the Roadhouse thing? Yeah. No, that's not. Oh, there it is. Oh, there that's, it is. It. that's it. Okay, so this is a combination. What's his name? Riley. That's the guy. He was. Uh, he had said that the chicken and beer song sounds like it could it could play in Roadhouse. Oh yeah. So they combined it, and now you actually this is what this is what would happen if that song was actually in Roadhouse. And let's let's blow it up there, Cody, if you can. Um, and let's let's see Dalton walking into the double deuce with chicken and beer playing in the background. Here we oh, go. Yeah. I love that he did the old school VHS. Oh, that's so great. That's so good. <laughs> so good. <laughs> but the, the sound is so good. <laughs> that extra is really not good. Terry Funk. Yeah. It works so well. Yeah. It works so well. Look at him. The Swayze and his fabulous hair. Oh. oh, yeah. Is that Jamie Costa? Gotta clean this place up. Yeah. Pain don't hurt. Yeah, listen to the music. It's perfect. I mean, it's perfect. <laughs> that guy was the worst. Ooh. Yes. Uh, <laughs> I, I can't wait it's for so Roxy good. to see this. <laughs> I didn't see that. That's a reaction. <laughs> that is really good. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. And, and look at Terry Funk's just throwing everybody around. Oh, so good. The uh, really good. the so extras, nice. the so, extras in Roadhouse. Like the, one of the reasons why Roadhouse is an endlessly rewatchable action movie. Not just because it's an Oscar-winning film. It's right. also because <laughs> the extras in that you can watch that and focus on a different extra. In the scenes, oh, yeah, so and bad. just so have bad. laughs yeah. for days. Trivia: Uh-oh. Who's the band in Roadhouse? Oh, I anybody? No idea. The, the, the blind dude, right? Yeah. Uh, Who's yeah. the band? <laughs> that is not an acceptable. Answer. But he's the, the blind dude. But he's the he's the singer. Oh, he, the blind kid. Blind dude. No, and he sits. Oh, he he plays me. the guitar in his lap. What do you have oh. on your feet? Hold on a second. What do you mean your feet? Concrete no, blocks. No, Doug Martens. That was not a Doc Martin. Yeah. That was yeah. that was like a Doc Martin. I can confirm it's Doc Martin. Yeah. God, oh, my so kneecap has just exploded. <laughs> but Doc they are Martin's strapped to concrete. <laughs> and I was trying to be nice to you. Is it somebody uh, uh, no. and the whatever, or is it just his it's, name? It's the blank band. Uh, the oh man, Roger Smith. I see band. him. I see him. He, yeah, Lon. The, the blank Healy. band. The Jeff Healy. Wait, I got it. I got it. Jeff Healy. I got it. They did not make it to Mexico. I don't know who they are. I don't know who they are. I bet if they played Angel Eyes. Yeah. I bet you've heard Angel Eyes. Yeah. Well, listen, it's good. Uh, it's a good bit of trivia. You know where else you can hear good trivia? 
March 23rd there at the Free is. For All. You can go there at the Free For All. Make sure you check hey, it out. Hey, Christian. Yeah. Let's move on. I don't want to move on yet. It's so, it's so adorable when Christian looks at me when he's I'm making so a segue because yeah. it's almost like he needs my approval. Right. Hey, you did good. Thank kid. you, buddy. I appreciate it. Wow. It's like it's the James Brown of segues giving me the approval. Big smile on his face. Are you right? Like he's, right. A, like he's a six-year-old. I took fishing for the first time. I call like, one. Yeah, you, there I call you go. One. Uh, let's move on. But but no, the free for all once again. It's going to be at the Globe Theater, not the Los Globos, like Ken has been saying. Oh. It's a to- to- totally different theater. It's the Globe <laughs> Theater the Globe. downtown <laughs> L.A. Downtown L.A. The Globe Theater, and it is um, it, it's going to be again. Right now, we have over almost three hundred people who have bought tickets. The and we're all going to be there. We will be. We're the downstairs be holds about four hundred, and the balcony holds about another two or three hundred. So you can get your tickets at the schmodownlive.com. Do Make sure, yes, please do it. Make sure do that you do it. Do it's maybe my. I, I, I love so many of the events that we do on a yearly basis. This is the only one we're doing in LA this year, so that's yes. exciting. Um, it's like our, our our Southern West Coast swing, and the free for all is so cool because I even like to surprise myself because I'm announcing it with Christian the whole time this year. I think I popped into it last twice. Year. Yeah, you twice? had the suitcase yeah. last year. Oh, yeah, I had the suitcase. Yeah. It, was, it was very. I funny think the suitcase fit. is still you here. Can check it out. Uh, it actually is still yeah. here, and and the the neck pillow because yeah. I don't like neck pillows. But uh, you and I are announcing it the whole time. Yeah, there's now forty competitors. 40. And I don't like no unless there's something I need to know that you will let me know pre-show. I like to be surprised myself oh, as who's, to coming, who's out. coming out. Yeah. It could be celebrities, it could be Schmodown luminaries, it could be some random bobblehead. It, there's going to be a lot of fun, and you're going to be constantly surprised during that show. That yeah. is the most fun I've had watching one yeah. is the free for all. It was it's just you know. Are you going to be on hand? Are you in town? I'm I'm gonna go there and watch and be infuriated that I when I know things and I'm like <laughs> I think I can yeah. do this. I think I can do this. Yeah. You know, like yeah. every time though when we're watching, it's always like oh what. Didn't he get that? Like they time, that time, Roca messed up the Marty McFly question. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Remember that, the, un- that, the underwear question? Yeah, everyone oh, yeah. remembers that question. Yeah. yeah. What did he say? Fruit of the Loom or something? Yeah. So what was the yeah. name that he used? He said Fruit of the Loom. Yeah. It's like Brad Gilmore and Frank Janish just shut him off out of his yeah. life. Yeah. Out of it's their just life a, forever. It's a so, yeah, massive we're, brain we're, fart. But we're all giving him crap about it. But then I think that could have happened to me. Yeah. When that you're under, well, not that one. Yeah. I'm not that dumb. So many times. There are so many brain farts I've done in the Schmodown. It just happens. Your big one was scream. Uh, what so that was, was it? Yeah, it was so, Sandlot. Yeah, so it, well, basically, he was in the speed round with with Roka, and, and it oh, was name name the movie from the following characters, and it was like uh, Dewey. Uh, <laughs> oh no, what's, Sydney. Sydney. No. Uh, yeah, uh, what Ghost, did you Ghost say? Face. Go, so then, Ghost what, face. what got me though was that everybody in the audience. Knew I should have known this, right? Because right. I'm a horror guy. Yeah. And they all went, oh, and I went completely off the rails and went, oh, uh, Sandlot. Yeah. yeah. He, oh. he goes, he goes, he goes space, Sandlot. That's but, so but when, sad. Uh, Cody, if you, I don't know if you can find it, but it's like it's if you go to the Roka Riley match, <laughs> just to the speed round. Riley's reaction when he when he goes, he's like, oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm an idiot. It's yeah, like no, you, it's like you went, blacked out and I came went, back to life. Oh. Fuck! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just, <laughs> just, just get so to the pissed. speed round. It is really funny once he actually gets it. It's, oh, like it's, it's one of the last questions in the speed round. But he just oh, his reaction because he realizes that he f- really messed yeah. up and you and he catches himself. Uh, uh, Jeff Healy band. It was too uh. late. <laughs> it was too late. Yeah, it's, it, it's just, uh, is this? Is that? It? Here we go. Round four. Oh, it's, it's like one of the. It's like the second or third it question. The... Right? Uh, yeah, keep go a little further. Nice costume there. Oh, yeah, I'm quite a kid. Daniel son. Yeah, I oh, crane yeah. kicked Roke in the face at one. Yeah. So uh, try the fourth. Yeah, it's coming up. Yeah, it's the f- it's either the fourth or fifth. So Maybe instead the last of you're one. the best around, where you're hearing you're the worst. Yeah, here we around. go. Is this it? Oh, no. all right. I won. So uh, here we go. Turn it up. <laughs> what else? Oh, you did. Good job. I did. Yeah. Here we go. Yep. Yeah. Here. Characters with the following names: Billy, Gale, Sydney, Dewey, Tatum, Still me. Cotton, <laughs> Ghostface. Watch Riley. See, Look. The Sandlot? <laughs> oh, oh, and oh, minus, oh. minus one. Minus Watch one. Riley. We're looking for Scream. Oh my god. Looking. <laughs> for what the fuck is wrong with <laughs> 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 you? Away. That really good. You can see it because when you yeah, hear yeah, the crowd, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I like tried to hold together. I'm like, well, <laughs> at, <laughs> at the <laughs> time, yeah, because at the yeah. time, he, he and Clark Wolf were partners. Yeah. And Clark Wolf was like the horror. Yeah, she's like, he's yeah. got this. Yeah. And she on the side was just like, 
who, who's sitting at the table <laughs> right now? I'm reading the question, and I'm like, why am I this far deep into the names? Yeah. Because it's not just yeah. Riley. Com- John Roke is yeah. a great trivia competitor. Yeah. Neither one of them yeah. got it. When if if you don't get it on Ghostface, you got to get it on Tatum. <laughs> right. or you got to get it on Cotton. Sydney. Sydney. I should have gotten Sydney. on Sydney, 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 Sydney Dewey, 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 Cotton. I should have. That's Jeff yeah. Healy. Yeah. Jeff Healy. Well, you're, lucky, you, I know it. you're lucky you still won that match. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. If you would uh, Seriously, though, because Roka lost that match, the one you're talking yeah, about, yeah. the uh, Fruit of the, the Loom one. one? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, if he would have won that match, nobody would have been, been talking about that. Yeah. Right. Because right. the same thing, Riley won that match, nobody talks about yeah. that. If he mm. lost it, it's the biggest flub oh. of all time. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, anyway, so um, but come, yeah, come check us out, guys. The com will be downtown L.A., and then we're going to be in Chicago. If you're going to be in Chicago, we'll be there the following uh, month. There's a lot of stuff going on. Mark's got his full comedy hour on April 12th, so you can check that out. Go to his website. I always, it's Mark. MarkEllisLive.com, right? Yeah, you can get all the Schmodown tickets there, too. If you oh, want. great. One-stop so, shopping. Wow. And there Seattle. You go. There Seattle, you go. too. We're Seattle. Yeah. We're March all 14th. going to Seattle. We're all going to Chicago. Damn. It's going to be so fun. You guys Just one big, on. happy Partridge yeah. family. Yeah, you'll yeah. Be, so you'll be free for all. You'll be at Chicago and Seattle? Mm-hmm. Look at you. Yeah. Wow. Traveling roadie. Yeah, like I'm very excited. I like it. What's your panel in Seattle? What do I, do I need to prepare? Just soundtrack stuff. So you okay. can talk about It's all the soundtracks. Are you going with Claudia? Yeah. Oh, Claudia's going also? Yeah. Okay, yeah, cool. Yeah. we got to get Claudia on this show. You sure. should. Yeah, she yeah, should talk about scores. the best. Yeah. If she comes into the show, request yeah. a Loki appearance. Okay. Because her dog is Her dog is awesome. Adorable. What kind of dog? It's like a tiny little chihuahua mutt, and it got lost for like a week. Oh, I and, remember. I remember. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, then yeah, 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 it's yeah. a full chihuahua! I was going to say the same thing. <laughs> Damn it. Got Christian on sat one. on it, and he saw <laughs> it. I did. I did sit on it. I let it go. That was Cam Newton looking at yeah. the fumble in the Super Bowl, and then it somebody go. else jumping in. I had it I had it like 20 seconds before he had it, too, and I let it go. <laughs> Are you drinking Dasani? I, it, no, right, Aquafina. Do all right, don't do it. it well, you got to get No, I know. You taught me that. Put salt in the water. Yeah. That's, why you, get, that's why you get thirsty. It's a ripoff. Yeah, yeah, so they're selling it all the Christian, Are you serious? Is this Christian, like a myth or is it true? No, old man it's Christian's it on, here. It's the only <laughs> bottle of water. You, you're, like, you're, look, you're talking to me like you're my dad yeah, right now. You're like, you. they put salt on the water. It's a ripoff. Yeah, it's he, a ripoff. They sell he them he all gets the on a soapbox for Dasani. Yeah. Wow. He, he literally, he yeah. acts like it, they're serving oh, yeah. you Lake Erie yeah. water. By the way, right? next week's sponsor, Dasani. Let's move on. It's the salty water. There's a lot of shit that we got to talk about because this is a shorter show. Um the big, the, the big story that we have to talk about. I know we were going to talk about Kendrick Lamar, obviously, and we will get to that. But look, I'm not a Patriots fan. <laughs> but <laughs> man, what a story Whoops. that <laughs> drops today. What a scoop. R- what a scoop. What a twist. Uh, Robert Kraft, the, the owner of the Patriots, um, was in Florida, decides not to get some sun, nope. decides to get a little bit of a... A nook nook at a, uh, <laughs> a, a yeah a little, oh yeah it goes to it goes Hey-o. to a, goes to a spa it does his research finds out what spa is giving him out the uh, free handies I guess yeah. and he goes to the to the spa and he solicits some sex and turns out that the same place is also a human trafficking place and yeah. not not a good look for the owner of the Patriots yeah not a good look this is uh, this is my thing okay because it's not look if the guy. Is, is he married? His wife passed away okay. about five years ago. All right, look. He's got guy, a young girlfriend, the, I think, right? Whatever. If the guy's looking to get laid, uh, it's not to me that he was going out looking for, for sex, right? This guy has so much money. Mm-hmm. Buy the fucking spa. Mm-hmm. Shut it down. <laughs> just shut the spa down. Shut the whole thing down. You know, find, do your research, buddy. <laughs> You're not just a guy. You're the owner of the championship Patriots. Yeah. Do your research and f- what what are, what are you doing? What are you doing? How dumb can you be? It's like, ah, eh, you know, no one knows who I am. I'm, I'm gonna pay for a hand job. <laughs> I mean, look, dummy. You know, look. you know who's happy about this though? Jesse Smollett. <laughs> right now, yeah, yeah. Right, now. <laughs> right now, gets you off the front page of Twitter. Yeah. yeah, but like, if if you're in the moment, you're down there in Florida. You're this rich old guy. Yeah. And Robert Kraft, he's an old guy. Mm-hmm. He just won the Super Bowl. He's rich. He's laying there. He's used to getting things he wants. So I'm not going to implicate him that he knows anything about human trafficking that goes right, on in that right. spot. I don't know about I, that. Maybe he does. I, yeah. I don't but, know. But, but he's pro- in all likelihood, he's laying there. Send them to your house. Uh, uh, dude, in the moment, you're getting a massage. It's right there. You're naked. Your ass is hanging out. A hand goes like that. And yeah. you're like, what are you going to do? Punt in the red zone? This is a football <laughs> guy. You, you end up scoring, and then you leave. You think it was a? You think it was one of those things that like they were they were you know, tracking him, and I don't know. Probably. It was yeah. a sting on the place, I heard. Yeah, it was. Like, it they, was. They've been, and he just happened to be he, there? Yes. Yeah. Bad luck. They so, have is been it, so is it a place that he frequented, then? 
I, I, and, I don't and know. Like he, and maybe he knew. I just what heard was they going was on? a sting operation. It was probably because they suspected of human trafficking, okay. sex trafficking. Yeah. You know. Yeah, yeah it, it, I don't it, think it, he that, knew that's, about that's, that. That's the murkiness. I, he might have. I, I, I don't know if he. I don't know. I, if he don't, know. I don't think these people seem nice. So you never yeah. know. Yeah. Adam Schefter. Robert Kraft is not the biggest name in sex trafficking investigation. Holy. Uh oh, mackerel. I wonder if the other one That's, is... Look at that, look. Hey, it was just a handy. <laughs> 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 Pinky in the bing. Come on, guys. <laughs> oh, Pinky in the bing. That's what you do when you go to Florida, right? Yeah, you know, I, that's the first thing I do. You win a championship, and I'm Pinky yeah. in the bing. <laughs> Where are you going? I'm going to Florida. <laughs> Pinky in the bing. And then Disney World. And then Disney World after that. When, oh, I missed you, Brent. That's my first stop off. <laughs> Not my last. Oh, what was the biggest? I mean, look, in, in the world of sports, Robert Kraft's a pretty big Pretty game. big. But, yeah, well, look, that just says not Oh, the big... I hope it's Dan Snyder. Oh, God, I hope it's Dan Snyder. I hope it is the owner of the Redskins, Dan Snyder. I hope he is responsible for all of this. Get him out. Real nice. God, this would be great. Oh, man. Oh, listen, that, this, is, this is rough. This is rough. This is, uh, again, this has nothing to do with being a, 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 a not a fan of the Patriots. This is this is this is rough. It's just it's really stupid. Like, <laughs> it's just really stupid. If you're if you're this guy, this high profile guy who goes into just at some random spa, yeah, and he's seventy seven. His balls too. waxed, yeah. or whatever That's he was doing. He's an old seventy seven too. Very, very. Yeah, and he's he's a lot of miles on that. Yeah, he's got. A, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, apparently he's still got some juice. Yeah, he's still, <laughs> hey, <laughs> still kicking. Oh God, Brian, let's take some calls. Where's how do you the, feel about this? Thing? Uh, how do I feel about this? Yeah. Oh God, it, it's awful. Yeah. It's awful. I mean, it, the, I've been reading this report because I wanted to get all the facts. But yeah, they they were under investigation for a while. He might have been. It, he just walked in the wrong place. They, wrong they are, should I go um, into Subway? Robert Robert Kraft. <laughs> should I go in? Maybe he's just an old guy and got lost. He's yeah. denying right. it right now. He's saying that the, the, his people are saying he was not a part of any illegal activities. Well, but, of course, uh, his people are going to say that. Yeah. Right. They're not going to be like, oh yeah. Unless there's video. I, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> he's it's, guilty. Yeah. It's kind of awful. It's not yeah. him in the video. Right. Ah oh, shit. It's an X Men. No, I just oh. thought of it. Fuck. What? Damn what? It. Thinking about it. Okay, so I made a joke on Twitter about because they. <laughs> it was funny to read it because it's like Jupiter police busted That's Robert Kraft, good. and I'm like like interplanetary cops came yeah, from yeah, Jupiter yeah. to bust Robert Kraft, and now I start thinking about it, and um, oh, there's a oh did boy, this is tough. Before? No, oh. but in Jupiter, Florida, Jupiter, Florida is a very affluent community. A lot of rich people live there. A lot of gated people, uh, you know. And Jupiter, Florida, I believe, is one of the places where a, a certain golfer owns a home. Oh, oh. Tiger! Wow. wow. Yeah. So what? Do you think it's him? I I don't want it to be Tiger. Oh. I, oh damn it! Oh, I'm just I'm worried about it. Tiger doesn't need, no, but Tiger doesn't God. need. Christian, no, neither God, does Robert please, Kraft. No, Robert no. Kraft ain't Tiger Woods. No. I, don't, I know he's got money. No. But, yeah, but but, but, he, but but Tiger Woods is smooth. Tiger Woods is smooth. Tiger, but there's I'm, I'm he, wasn't Tiger very, he wasn't very smooth when he got caught and his wife yeah. like, exactly. you know, found out, out and he I'm ran into a tree. Yeah, I was there's like, difference what do you between mean by smooth? stupid and smooth. What I mean by smooth is that he can get a lot of women. He's been able to get a lot of sure. women. And yeah, good but you can women. be both smooth and stupid. Yeah, he's smooth. That's what I said. I said he's smooth and stupid. But yeah. I, I said he was stupid for the way that, he, first of all, for cheating on his wife, second of all, for getting caught for it. But I don't think, oh, who the hell, what do I know? I, if you told me yesterday, well, well, maybe Robert Kraft will show up and, and get a, get his you know his candle waxed See, off, and I would, yeah. I don't think that's going to happen. These, pe these people just have too much money, and that's why they go yeah. crazy. You're talking about that's people that we have no concept of what they like, right. what they can Mentor. get anything, and that, that doing something bad like that has got to get them more, right. off more he, than yeah. the, the. He hand. probably he yeah. probably yeah. did go in a subway first, asked the subway yeah. guy for yeah. a little you yeah. know manouche, and, yeah. and then. Oh, said, fine. No, I'll go there's with a the... spa next door. <laughs> yeah, fine. Like... yeah, their mentality is not like ours, where it's like, oh, I hope I don't get caught. Their mentality, these are these people are like Thanos. Yeah. They're they're like, I own everything. Yeah. I'm gonna walk in. Like, imagine if the yeah. cops busted Thanos and he'd be like, What what are you kidding? I'm right. I'm well, Thanos. Well, that's what yeah. I'm saying. I was just, but just buy the spa. But do you think when he walked into Subway he asked for a foot long or a six inch? <laughs> Depends on what he's uh, working <laughs> with. Yeah. Yeah. Oh right. yeah. Let's move on. <laughs> um, I do I, look. The other thing is the Oscars just w more and more. So, it, it's just such a mess. A mess. Like, are you guys actually looking forward on Sunday? I feel like I'm still yeah. I'm still over, but at the same time, it could just be such an entertaining. Only shit show. Only because I have four hundred dollars on the line. Wow, right? that's it. That's that's uh, four hundred dollars to win. Um, right. That's the only reason I'm really looking forward to. I'll be more invested now than I've ever been. Um, I don't care who's hosting. I'm just going to watch the Nobody's awards. Nobody's hosting. 
Well, that's yeah, why no, that's right. why I want to watch it though. You that's why I'm shit show so it intrigued. Yeah. I, I it's, you want to watch a car crash? There's a, this yeah. thing. This is like the Oscars version of the the Schmodown free for all. Right, right. Because you have yeah. no idea who's coming out, and yeah, I think yeah. that that's I think that there is something exciting about that. They they back their way into it. Yeah. They're like Kramer and Seinfeld. They're like they they fall ass backwards into opportunity. Because I think a lot of people <laughs> are going to watch this because they want to know who is coming out next. Right. There's so yeah. much mystery surrounding this. I have a feeling. Billy Crystal comes show out up? early uh, in the show. Hold on, but there's a rumor. What's the rumor? And I and I learned it from Snyder Uh-oh. yesterday on Movie Talk yeah. that there that it's Whoopi Goldberg yeah. has been missing for a week <clears throat> or two on the View. Okay, and they said that it was pneumonia, but Joe Bay, uh, Joy Behar said something. I can't. I don't know the specifics, yeah. but. The rumor is yeah. that she's the secret host. Because she's, be yeah. she's hosted before. Because she's hosted before, hosted before and yeah. said that she wanted to. Uh, she knows again. how to do it. I'd yeah. be down for that. Uh, Whoopi's yeah. great. Whoopi's able to. I mean, listen, she'd be heaven sent, and then she can. She'd be gonna, perfect. They're going to owe her a big favor yeah. for yeah. a long time. And her and Billy did, did comic relief together. Yeah, Ren so. Robin. Mm-hmm. Yeah, back in the day. So. Um, but what's the news that Kendrick, Kendrick is not Lamar playing, right? Kendrick Lamar is it's basically a, said, yeah. no which, thanks. I'm not going to do it. Well, I'm pissed because that's the only song I cared about. But you know what? Fuck the Oscars because they didn't allow. Man or Muppet from the Muppets movie mm-hmm. to be performed. So whatever. Well, but mm. what the official reason is that he says is logistics and timing. Mm-hmm. Uh, to me, that's we didn't know about this when you signed on in the first place. Is, that you were going to do well, it. He's also a busy dude. I know, but yeah. you know when the Oscar like Childish he, Gambino didn't show he, up to the Grammys. Yeah. He wants nothing to do with this thing. I bet you. Yeah, I, w- I wouldn't be true. surprised if he if he's friends. Maybe he's friends with some of the people that got screwed the, this time around. Maybe maybe he just. It's just a dirty thing. Like a lot yeah. of people, a lot of people were offered the job. By the way, after Kevin Hart went, I'm Bye. good. I'm yeah. busy. Meaning, thankless job. No thank you. And so, if Kendrick Lamar is like, I just don't want to do it. Yeah. Imagine that I'm, life. Well, I'm a little busy for the Oscars. I'm gonna go to a spa in Florida yeah. instead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. At the Oscars. Next yeah. to I'm excited to see. Uh, I want to see Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga do that song. Yeah. I think that would be cool. Yeah. yeah. They're gonna perform that live and like you know I. I like watching the uh, I like watching the hosting aspect of it, so I am interested in that just to see what the hell yeah. happens. But yeah, if Whoopi walks on stage, I'd be okay. With she's it. got a standing ovation. Yeah, Did like you... anybody that walks on stage that has the, the, the that has the mentality of yeah, I'm gonna go host this thing that is uh, apparently unhostable. They deserve a standing ovation. Yeah. I hope yeah. that audience is good and not shitty like they usually are. Yeah, well, I mean, I think that a lot of people in the audience. In the actual audience itself, will feel the same way that you did. Like, what is going to happen tonight? Mm-hmm. Like, I think that it was funny because I don't remember who I was talking to about this, but it's the fact that most people have no idea about any of the drama going yeah. on with uh, with the Oscars. I, I think that they no know clue. that Kevin Hart's not hosting. Yeah, yeah I but, think that's what they know. And but I think that a lot of the conversation the day of the Oscars, like like in people's houses, are going to be who is hosting? Right. Who the, is hosting? Right. It's, it, they, it's the big drama the itself. They might have heard about it in passing. Get they the TV they guide, Harold. Right. They weren't in it like <laughs> we were. You know, because I can tell you, my wife lives here, has no idea what the hell's going on with the with the yeah. Oscars, right? My mother in law, that, that's that, forget it. it um, but nobody does. Anybody no. that's not a nerd that's on these shows, like yeah. all no, of us, no, it's nobody. True. My nobody dad says me the other day, yeah. "Who's hosting the Oscars?" Uh, it's like, it's, I said, "You know, I, this whole is that how I, your dad talks?" Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yes, yes, yeah. it is. Who's, Always who's host? <laughs> uh, why? Why is that? I, that first is, time, first time I saw his old man after after Christian's wedding, he was like, "Hey, Mark." You're not drunk today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're not drunk. All right. What's the uh, what's our Schmodown Patreon level like? How much do you have to pledge a month in order to watch the Oscars with your mother-in-law? <laughs> <laughs> They'd have to pay me. Uh, uh, Nine. Or I have to pay them. Nine. Uh, yeah, but it's a uh, it's it's. Uh, I would do that. Pat's great. Hey, so wait a minute. Who's nominated tonight? <laughs> she does well, the thing that she does. It drives me nuts. No, that one shouldn't win. Why? <laughs> That's the one that should win. What? Did you see that one? No. Did you see that one? No. What about that one? No. That's the one I like, though, and it should win. Fine. You know, the Oscar movie I finally caught last night? What? Uh, the Wife. Aye. Oh, how, yeah. She's, it, it's good. She's the winner. Fan. Yeah. It's good. She's and the, she's I told you so that. awesome. She's the winner. I, I was watching she's it. Great. Like, halfway through the movie, I'm like, all right, I'm giving you the statue. Yeah. And then the second half of the movie, I'm like, I'm like just trying movie. to, I'm, now I'm trying to predict which scene they play oh, yeah. when she get when, when you know, they stay like, and you yeah. n- go in close. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, and the whole like, role, which one? The whole role is an evolution of a character. You really yeah. see the strength of this character just kind of, it, it, it's it's pretty rich. There's uh, some her. simmering. Yeah, the story itself is fine, but she, 
it's it's what she does for the yeah. character mm-hmm. is so intriguing that I think it's not even a legacy award because I know a lot of people are going to be saying that that's what it is. It's not just that. She's never won. So yeah. that will help. But she legit, yeah. I think, is the best out She's of all of them. She's so great. I yeah. won't be ignored. Yeah. Are you going to watch it? Daniel. Billy? No? No. Why not? <laughs> no, what? Are you going to watch the Oscars? Um, yeah, I think... I think I, w- I was supposed to be shooting something, but I might watch it now. I don't know. Oh. Just I, I, I used to be like hopeful as I watched it and, and be like, that's going to be me someday. And I'm, right. now I'm like, fuck all of you. <laughs> <laughs> Realizing your dreams like that. Like, like, <laughs> what are you wearing? Wear this, motherfucker. <laughs> but, uh, that's a song. Wear this, motherfucker. <laughs> Get on it, throw And I realized <laughs> I, that from Oscar shows, I really need a team. If yeah. I had a team, well, everything what, would be gold. What are we? Maybe if you showed yeah. up like the fucking show. Like a full team to thank. I'd like to well, thank hey. my team. Mm-hmm. So wh- well, you're not running and getting stuff for me. That team Alex like does. That. He gets well, his Alex. water. Speaking of which, I'm out of my Aquafina. <laughs> hey, Alex. <laughs> hey, Alex. Alex, bring in some Dasani, please. Please. Oh, yeah, so we can get thirsty five minutes later. Oh, God. Scam artist. <laughs> it's uh, got salt in it. He won't yeah. drink it. Like, you can no. offer so him weird. an No, you just, so if you're thirsty, you just won't no, drink no, no. it. No, no, when they, they, I can't, there's a reason. <laughs> when you go to the AMCs and when you go to the screenings, they give you the free popcorn and the water, right? Yeah. But the water, the free water, it's always the Sini. And if you try Dasini. to get whatever it is, the Sony, the Sony, <laughs> when you try to get like the, the other one, the really good one, they oh, no, no, we don't, we don't yeah. give you that. We don't, you, that doesn't come with the free. You got to buy that one. You know yeah, what? because you're not drinking salt water. <laughs> you know what I'm going to do? What? Until you watch the thing. Just f- I'm just going to give you. Waterboard gonna, me with uh, yeah, exactly. Dasani. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. yeah, it's unbelievable. Does the Sony have salt water in it? See, yeah. Does, Does Lacroix have salt in it? I don't care. I like the some of the yeah. Uh, the, you, there are some that have sodium. Some of those sparklers. Yeah, it's what added for it? taste. However, Dasani. Yeah. So look, it, it gets you. It gets you thirsty and makes you keep going back. Freshly yeah, bottled right, at right, the right. Santa Zoom Monica that, Pier. But it's Zoom. like, don't you just don't you eat salt anyways no, 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 during that, the day that, that, that makes you thirsty? But you're drinking water. You're supposed to. <laughs> can wait. Can, potassium can, chloride is, is is another ingredient. Can that the crew? Dasani... Can the crew click on? Does Aquafina have salt? Wait, wait for a second. Just wait. I want to read this thing first before you click onto it. It's is an it's another ingredient that the Sony claims is added for taste. However, it tastes salty with a metallic aftertaste because of the sodium inside of the water. Drinking the Sony yeah. will make you thirsty and want to buy more. Dicks. Okay, yes. that that's a little that, that that's a little like now we're putting our own opinion into this. Yeah, that comes from the official board. Or just Christian. Yeah, that's, that's the official board. It's gonna make you want to buy more. What does it yeah. trick your brain? I don't know no. who the official board is, but I believe it's Aquafina from the... does not put sodium in it. See? See? I told yeah. you, it's the only water that does it. I don't yeah. usually buy this. This You're was in my so glove upset. compartment as a backup. Because it's a ripoff. It's the only thing when you go to the movie theaters. It's the only one that they sell because that's why you're sitting there. You want to, why you get so thirsty and you're spending six dollars a bottle and then you buy two of them and then, then they get you in the pocket. It's like it's like it's, it's like they get you. No, it's like Lethal Weapon Two. They fuck you with the drive through. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you with yeah. the Sony. It's a conspiracy. Back in Bullshit. my day, you build your own house, and then you go to the well and you drink mm-hmm. whatever water yep. is in yeah. the well. Yeah. Some so they, little kid fell down there. You're drinking the little kid. Fueled water, baby right? Jessica. Speaking of conspiracies, yeah. there is so there are so many conspiracy documentaries on Netflix. Yeah. You guys, there's you a flat them? Earth <laughs> documentary. Oh, I, saw I am your obsessed tweet with last flat, night. flat Earthers. Yeah. Flat Earthers what are that? fascinating. Right? You don't oh, know what flat, flat Earthers are? I know what it is. Obviously, the Dude. people who actually think that it's, yes. it's just flat. Well, we just yes. how though? We how? just lost three listeners. <laughs> <laughs> how? But how? I mean, I don't understand. Can how do they can, think that? Can you have you not seen footage from space? No, but they think it's all think a it's lie. Fake. They think there's literally people that have the NASA stick bumper sticker in their cars, but instead of NASA, it says lies. Yeah, <laughs> this, hurts, this hurts my is, head. Is is yes. the documentary from the angle of we're gonna like observe these people in their quirky ways, or is it like no, no, no this documentary is trying, trying to win you yeah, over that just the Earth like, is flat? Yeah, it's just I like discovering this, Bigfoot. I see it. It's yeah. like the Bigfoot so, one. So they don't believe in space and planets. No, and, no. no, no. They think Wait. it's all flat, and they and there's YouTube videos too where people are. But telling these people that have been smashed in the head with cinder blocks, right? Uh, when you watch wow. the moon landing video, ah, yeah, there's some shadows there. Yeah. I don't know who that shadow's uh, supposed to be well, there at the time. K- Kubrick ah, shot that. Kubrick, Kubrick yeah. 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 Kubrick that, did a masterpiece I, of that. I, that's the stupidest. The moon landing thing is the stupidest yeah. thing. The, out of all the conspiracies, I'll, I'll get with you on the JFK stuff. I'll get with you on that. You better. I will. I know I'll, the guy who I'll, killed yeah. him. I'll get with you on the <laughs> Cigarette JFK Cigarette smoking stuff. man from he, the Expos yeah, killed him. I'll really, I mean, there's a lot. Um, other conspiracies we gotta have conversations about, but the moon landing one is the dumbest one. No, a the, dumber, worse than the, flat earths? The, no, 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 it's the second. Flat okay, earths. but, yeah. the, but multiple flat no, earths. Yeah. It's, it's pretty, it's pretty the dumb. The flat earths? 
flats? <laughs> right. The, the air flats? I am 80. I am, I'm going to say I'm 83% sure we landed on the moon. Yeah, I, I, 83%. The fact 83%. that you don't touch up that seven, yeah. other 17, I, I'm going to well, call you, you a moron. Well, you keep drinking that salt-based water yeah. that the yeah. government's shoving in your face. They the put Russians, nanobites in it. All the stuff the Russians have done, okay, mm -hmm. to us already. They, were, they wanted to be the first to land on the moon. Mm -hmm. Don't you think... If Kubrick shot the fucking moon landing, they would have gone every which way to find out that he did it. It would have been exposed. So stupid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it would have been exposed. <laughs> maybe it wasn't Kubrick. Maybe it was. Uh, yeah. Maybe it was Dennis Hopper. I, I can't believe so you're dumb. really just f f like finding this out now, or is like, what? have you heard the flat earthers and the, and the moon I know, landing? I know. Like, no, I've known. I've known all yeah. this shit. I'm just saying yeah. it doesn't make make it any less dumb. But there's, there's a yeah. lot of people that think that though. It's amazing. It's and it's, crazy. But what's funny is like they're not. I mean, it, I'm assuming that like, most of these people aren't like people that are spreading hate to minorities and things like that. But they just really are sure that the Earth is flat. Yeah. Like they're not hurting anybody. Yes, they're like, hurting my head. Yes, I know. But it's just it's so it's I love it. It's the best. It's Can you imagine hilarious. though, like like <sighs> if there was like like evidence that came out that the Earth was flat, like how we would all react? It, like the next day, it'd be like. Look at this. Well, uh, boy, do we have some yeah. news for you. There's this, there's a Twitter thing, yeah. a flat yeah. earth society. Every there are 75,000 yeah. people <laughs> following this thing. But some I bet you half of those are like me, though. Yeah. They're, just see the, they're just the obsessed with it. Yeah. Oh my That's, God. This is my look, reality TV. Look at that picture. Look at that picture. That's yeah. what they think it looks like. We're, oh, oh they, so they do think Had, we're in space. Yeah. yeah. They think we're in space. We're just floating around flat. I'm, some of them. Some okay. of them might prove you wrong. So they do think we're actually in space. Yeah, some of them think that we're in this bubble thing. Okay. And, or capsule. <laughs> Great. Have you seen the the meme of like, oh, if like the Earth was flat, cats Space. wouldn't be able to throw uh, everything listen. off the edge. So mm. that's why the Earth isn't flat. Uh, I want to know. I'm I, I'm really serious here. Is there anybody in this chat room who believes this? Because if there is, know. Alex will find you. Is and, Kyrie Irving and, in the chat? And you will call in. <laughs> we will find. I, I mean, right. how do you think this? It just it's how yeah, do you think it's this? fascinating. It's like the same thing like saying. I'm staring. I'm looking at an Indian woman right now. Yeah, you're not an Indian woman. It's is this you're weird? not. It's you know. I have a confession to make. <laughs> but it's you know what I mean. It's like, what, what are we talking about? It's it's so stupid. That in Dasani is pissing me off. <laughs> Let's move on. You guys, speaking of flat Earth, you guys see the uh, you guys see that Twilight Zone? Uh, yeah, the trailer. trailer? Yes, no. I'm Ooh, so excited. I cannot wait. This is something that will literally because like you you watch like oh it's cute that they're doing this or that. I'm not going to pay for this right. streaming service. CBS All Access. Just got my money. Yeah, same. With just because of the trailer. The they trailer even... is that good. But how much is the is the the service? I don't know, but I'm gonna pay for same. it. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't even get it. Got money Star coming out my ass. Doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> Sold out of a what? show in Chicago. Yeah. Yeah. What, what are you going to gonna go to a spot in Florida now? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to watch this. I'm getting That's why Alex was getting backing really it up. He's like, hey. I know. So uh, what happens when you get this big. Alex, when you're going through those comments, do you see anybody actually saying, I believe it, or someone just being, you know. I think they're just being ironic and uh, saying that it that they do believe it. You and just like uh, trying to get, on get the their air. attention. Oh. oh There's yeah. no way they believe it. There's no way. You never know. We gotta get a flat earther in here. I do. Well, have you gotta get one yes, in. Please, can we please it's interview like, someone? I, I want to. Oh, it's yes. like it's like Negan. Negan hit somebody in the head with his bat. Yeah. And like, oh, it's flat. Yeah. I know. Hell, look. I'll watch the documentary. Maybe the documentary oh, wins me over. Yeah. And I'll come in here and defend it next week. You are a big conspiracy guy, though. Big one. Yeah. I'll, I'll Is there conspiracies you believe in? A lot of them. Did you watch the Zeitgeist? All of them. Yeah. All of them. Yeah. All of them. Did you see yeah. that one? I mean, oh, the Zeitgeist, yes. Yeah. That, was, that one was I so get funny. deep in the rabbit hole with JFK. <laughs> the, the, that, that one's well, to that me. one's good, though. That one's read, a good one. Yeah, yeah but read, there's, like, there's levels of it. Yeah. Right. Have you ever read Jesse Ventura's book? No. Oh, you should. No. You, for, for JFK stuff? Really? Oh, yeah. Read it right now. Read it right now. Finish right. it up and Just come back kidding. and do a report. Right. Is he a conspiracy guy? Oh, yeah. Or is he a oh, single no, no, bullet he, theory No, guy? no. He's, yeah. on, he's, on, he's, he's There's no way he's saying. Didn't there's he have a name. show he where he was doing like conspiracy all, all, stuff? Yeah, on CNN, I think. Yeah. Yeah. But he's, a, yeah, he's, a, he's, he's like an ex-Navy ex SEAL. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and he's he is fascinating to me. He's fascinating. Just Body. Yeah. Um, but anyway, that's that's Check amazing. the sewer. What a rabbit that's hole. That's all I'm saying. Rabbit Check hole. the sewer. Let's get a couple phone calls, though. Let's do it. Let's, Cody, if we can fire up the phone lines here, and we'll do some hashtags for Collider Live. Riley, mm -hmm. got anything as Cody's getting the old uh, phone th stupid thing up? Yeah, let me look and see what's out there. Oh, good. All right. Perfect. Yeah. Anything else going on in the world of news that we should talk about before then? Or? Um, you know, something, uh, I'm trying to find confirmation, but John Krasinski just uh, tweeted out, time to go back, and they dated no. A Quiet Place 2 oh. for oh, okay. May 15, 2020. It looks like lost. he's coming back to direct. No, I thought oh, he's coming back to direct. It looks that way.
away. I yeah. thought he was going to say time to go back to the future. I was like, no. Oh, yeah, no, 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 no. Oh, Sorry. Yeah. Okay, oh, this didn't want to scare you there. No. Um, yeah, no. So that, that's some news that just broke. People were tagging me uh, saying, is, is it true? I'm trying to wait for a report to see yeah. if it's actually confirmed because he's hinting that he's returning I'm, as a director. I'm that's awesome. On, you see, I'm on, I'm on two different sides of it. Uh, one, it would be great if he came back because he did such a fantastic job with yeah. the first one. And, and he knows he knows it. He would be able to direct. Uh, obviously, if, if Emily Blunt comes back and... They'll feel comfortable with him. He'll know how to tell the story, and it'll feel just like the first one. Is it Emily Blunt coming back, or is it a different time heard, and place? Yeah, heard it, we've heard it's a different time and place. Oh, okay. Maybe he'll focus on other survivors. Whatever, whatever it is. If he's doing it, he know he knows the world, and you know it's going to feel like the first one. So yeah. that's the positive. Right. The negative is that he just did this great movie. He's got this promising career as a director. I, I, I want to see him do something else. Right. Yeah. Uh, I mean, he could do the, he could do this because I, I guess like it's the Ben Affleck thing right Affleck started out with Gone Baby Gone which might be my favorite movie that he did to be honest with you it was the only one that he wasn't starring in I love the town and I love Dargo mm -hmm. the last one Live By Night was awful but he was also going through a lot of shit at the time but I just uh, I like how he was doing different things he didn't kind of franchise uh, franchise up and you got to see his different shops throughout his movies I think Krasinski could be that guy but I'm okay with this I just want to see him do something well, else what would, what would be the I mean what, where would you want it to go that would be a, different than what it was? I mean, I don't, I don't know what, that's a great what I need to like, know what, more what, of. What yeah. community do you live in that's not, that's less like farm based? Right. Or, yeah. or I, where 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 would you go in the quiet right. place universe? And then we figure it out the how to be the flat moon. We well, figured out how to beat yeah, them. Well, yeah, yeah, that's right. But that's what I want to see. Emily Blunt yeah. comes back. They just figured out how to beat them, and they have to tell their survivors, and right. it's a continuation it's kind of like the story. They live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Story, what, could be. They live. I was, weren't they supposed to do a remake of They Live? Probably. Not a remake. Yeah. A reboot, yeah. You know what I thought of today? I was driving in. I was thinking, you know what? I'm surprised they haven't done a remake of that. Mm. I wish that they would, and they could do it. The Golden Child. No. Oh. I'm thinking that, that's a good one. <laughs> I just won the crowd over. <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. Uh, oh, Vision, yeah. Vision Quest. Uh, okay. Confession time. Never seen Vision Quest. I've seen I've seen Vision Quest at least fifteen times. Oh, okay. I just can't make it past five minutes. What? Because mm. the beginning of the movie <laughs> is so inspirational and powerful. That's all you need. Watching Matthew Modine jog to Journey. I literally watch the movie, then I go out for a run, oh, and okay. I and I don't. And you've I, never I, seen past. I, that I, I had no idea the movie was about wrestling until <laughs> yeah. like two days ago. I love. So if somebody movie. wants to make you leave and go for a run, they just have to play that movie. Play that they have to song. play if they play only the Young by Journey. Yeah. It's a great running song. <laughs> Max Rodine is running. Yeah. He's training. It's like a, it's a whole thing. It's actually the reason why I thought of it because that song popped on in my car this morning. I was thinking about go. it. But um, great song. Here's a quiz for anybody who's seen that movie. Anybody in the room? Uh, you've never seen it, Riley. But no, sorry, somebody, did, no, somebody. I'm looking at uh, hashtags, and I'm like, well, you missed half the show, dude. We already talked about it, okay. so no worries. Vision Quest. Uh, the Who played the dad in Vision Quest? Mm, I'm going to go with... No. Uh, ah, damn it. going to go with a... Uh, <laughs> going to go with Ned Beatty. It's incorrect. Riley, do you guess? Guess. Uh, I know Linda Fiorentino. Robert Loggia. No, good guesses, oh, though. Great good guess. guesses. Yeah. The answer is Ronnie Cox from Robocop fame. Ah, uh, Beverly Hills Cop fame. Yeah. Yeah. What's the, I think I've seen a vision question, probably. It's great, yeah. Long yeah. time ago. You remember the, do you remember the, the main wrestler's name that he's got to fight? Uh, Needick. Nope. Oh. Shoop. From Saved by the Bell. Shoop. 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 All right, anyway. As in Dad Oop. Mm hmm. Let's get to a phone call. Let's move uh, on. Yeah, let's get to a phone call. You got some? Yeah, we, you should, we have one? All right, all right. Take it easy. Take it easy. Hey, you're stop it. You're in Collider Live. Who do we got? What's up, Collider? It's Tony Morrow. Look at you. You oh. finally made it in. You've been, you've been trying to scratch through the phone lines, and Tony, you've made it through. How are you, friend? What do you got for us today? How are you guys doing? Good, man. What's up? Uh, first of all, I believe the, uh, the Earth is a square shape. There you go. Mm, all right. So, flat mm. ask. Uh, second of all, Coke dealers love uh, beignets in uh, New Orleans. Um, mm, two for anyway, two. I wanted to ask. What's up? Two for two. <laughs> uh, I will be at the free for all, by the way. Oh, nice. Happy birthday weekend. Oh, is it going to be your birthday? Happy, happy, happy uh, almost birthday. Feliz cumpleaños. That's fun, man. Thanks. Wear a Burger King crown so we know how to identify you. Yeah. Yeah, so, oh, so what? We're wearing a Duster, uh, Rams cap. <laughs> cool. I know you're going to wear the Rams cap. So, uh, what's on your mind today, bud? Uh, so uh, they should really ask uh, like real comedians to host the Oscars, not like Billy Crystal or whatnot. They're real, but I'm talking about like the the comedians of today. They should ask uh, Bill Burr and uh, maybe Mark Marin to host the Oscars. Just kind of spice it up a little bit. It's a good conversation. Thank you for the call, Tony. I mean, look, you, you that's. 
it's interesting. But those two guys, those two guys are pretty edgy. Marin, yeah. I, I don't yeah. think I don't think Marin uh, wants to do it. Nah, uh, I don't think Bill Burr want, would want to do it. I think Bill Burr would do it. Um, I just don't think that the I think the Academy would uh, want to handcuff him. Would worry handcuff about him. Yeah, yeah, exactly. The yeah. Gervais. Uh, has kind of kept people away from that type of thing. Yeah, they want to say. I, I think exactly. if anything, Gervais, yeah, Gervais, when he hosts the Golden Globes, right, yeah. like illuminates that, hey, we're nervous about having a comedian yeah. Let's who... Let's not have the edgy ones. Yeah. Especially yeah. guys like that, right, because... They, just, they, don't, want, the, they don't, don't want anybody they yeah. can't control. Bill exactly. is also, like, the... Pro, it's like either him or... It, like he he might be the biggest best comic on the planet yeah. right now. I you know, love him. He's you know, doing a spe- he's, he's taping a special in London in a couple weeks, and like it's also like if you're Bill Burr, you're doing you're doing two nights at a five thousand seater in London taping yeah. your special. You're going overseas to places where English is not their first language, yeah. and you're selling out arenas. Yeah. Do, it, it, he doesn't need he to doesn't host need the to Oscars. Go, no. He might want to. Like it doesn't matter if I if I am headlining Madison Square Garden on at a residency. I would still want to host the Oscars because I I just think it's fun and I like I, I like movies and I like telling movie jokes. But I think that most comedians are like, what is this going to do for me? It's a thankless job. Uh, yeah, yeah, it really is, and it, they don't need it. But it, the they were the, Tony's suggestion is a good suggestion. I, I mean, I would love to see either one of those. Me guys too. Do I just it. I think the Oscars are way too safe for it. I'll tell you who I'm surprised has not been thrown out there. Or maybe they have been, and we just haven't heard about it. But Melissa McCarthy. Who's right. hosted many yeah. Saturday yeah. Night Lives? Be interested and like and she's awesome. And I don't. So I wouldn't want to see this particular comedian do it, but I could see where they would go after her, and that'd be Rebel Wilson. I could see mm-hmm. them do. Okay. Yeah. I think she she just annoys me after too long, but I could see her being entertaining for the whole entire show. I'm surprised they haven't. If maybe they have, I don't know. But I uh, want to see Rebel Wilson host I, it. I don't either, but I could see mm-hmm. where she could do it. I would. I, I, I would get really bored with I that. I don't fast. feel like they go with younger. People, I feel like they always go with some, like wh- who's the youngest, the, young, the youngest Jimmy host Kimmel, right? they've or, had. Or Fallon, Kimmel or McFarlane. Did Fallon do it yet? Uh, Jimmy Fallon's not hosted the Oscars. Why? Yeah, well, why hasn't Fallon done, done it? Because uh, it's, it's on NBC, NBC and, right, and ABC. Right, right. I would vote. For, I, I think. Uh, I think the perfect Oscars host would be Kamel Nanjiani if he wants to do it. Ah. He's got a lot of interesting things to say on Twitter. He's yeah. very funny. He's a great comic. He's he's in movies. He yeah. does movies, but he's not such an overwhelming movie star. That is like distracting from the fact that you can still comment on yeah. the industry a little bit, or because Jordan Peele, is, you know, he was nominated last year, and so that's a conflict of interest. But if Key and Peele want to reunite to host the Oscars, oh, I think that'd that be great. Oh, that would be great. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. All right, cool. So Riley, what else you got on? Yeah, I got a hashtag here. Thanks for for this because it's breaking. Charles King at Dark Silver sixty nine oh five. Jesse Smollett has been cut officially from Empire. Okay. Yeah, well, shocking. Yeah, yeah last yeah, two shocking. episodes because you know he was arraigned. Posted bail, showed up walked the set, to the right? set, yeah. and there was like, then it was quiet for a little bit, and now it's confirmed. What's wow. that day like when you show up? I can't mm. imagine. You know? <laughs> hey, I can't how's, imagine. Your week? how's your weekend? I don't think anybody's working that day. Right? That's what I mean. Yeah. Like, he's like, hey, he's coming in. I will not be there. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, how rough, awkward is that? Like, it's just weird that you hire two people to beat you up to get into work. Like, right. if I'm walking to work, I'm like, man, I wish two guys would just jump this so I don't have to go today. But, like, to get more work, you do that. I saw a funny uh, meme with him, though, too. Someone said, like, life is hard. Don't beat yourself up. <laughs> oh, <laughs> wow. It's pretty funny. Uh, there's some big news, too. What big big mo- uh, news in, in the world of movies. Do you guys hear this? No. Last night, Riley, I know you heard it. What? They moved up the release date of uh, yes. Godzilla. Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So excited. Yeah. 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 March, March, right? March 13th, yeah. 2020. You guys have to take me to a screen. Yeah. Well, yeah. What does that mean? Does, and, that, does that mean they have a lot of confidence in Godzilla too. That you means that means? that means that Godzilla's days are numbered. They, is what it no, means. But no, it means that no. King Kong. Uh, is, no. I, I don't even think the movie's going to be an hour long. I think the movie's going to be a tidy thirty-five minutes. Kong gets up there, knocks him out one punch, no. shows him you know, out. You know, so you think so you're rooting for Kong? Wait a minute. Huge. No, I'm a huge no. Kong guy. Guys, Gogeta. You, no. Everybody knows the way this movie's going to go, right? They're going to fight in like the yeah, first 10 minutes and they're going to team up. Mothra's I mean, going to fly in and it's over. Yeah, they're both. <laughs> yeah, okay. What was that? <laughs> that's pretty, that was that's decent. Damn, that's a guess. That's, that's really good. My dragon Better call than my was that. Was, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, Kong, Kong versus Godzilla they moved away from Fast and Furious 9's release date. That's kind of Smart. what the move was. Okay. Do you I think, don't care about Fast and Furious. Yeah. Is I that do. bad? I get a kick out of them. Yeah. I do get a kick out of them. I, the, the Hobbs and Shaw, is that what it's called? That's mm-hmm. going to be fun. I'm going to see that. That's Makes fine. me nervous. Yeah. I mean, the, the movie superhero, was so stupid. The superhero stuff is... Oh, why, yeah. why are we doing that? Why are we doing this, this super serum? It who looks, ca- who cares? Yeah. It's just going to be stupid fun. 
Who cares? I, I, well, because it just it just go, yeah, it's but is, is, is anybody like, oh, you're ruining the sanctity of no, the Fast and no, Furious no, franchise? I just don't think they needed that. I think that it was already turning into a cartoon comic book anyway with all the stuff that they, they could jump from building to building. I don't need Super Serum now. They already have Super Serum. I it, need Super Serum. Yeah, everybody does. Oh, yeah. I could go from, I, I got to go on a run after this and it's not going to go well. No, you're going to listen to Just play the to, Journey uh, Zone. Only the Young, yeah. Mm. Go, oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah. You're all right. right. That's, you're uh, absolutely right. You got a phone call, Cody? Yeah. All right. Hey, yeah. you're in Collider Live. Who do we got? Hey, I just wanted somebody to know here in the office, oh, specifically Wendy. to people who use the kitchen, um, somebody <sighs> left a stovetop on oh. this morning. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Almost burned my fingers. Oh, oh, oh. Did I, turn, I left the stovetop on. Oh. That, oh. That, that, <laughs> Wendy <laughs> calling him out. I thought she wanted she, to put that out there. Oh, oh, yeah. I, Wendy. See, I thought she was going to call. I was ready to defend myself. I thought she was calling about because in the morning I'll do the eggs and I'll leave the pan. Yeah. And I had to do it this morning because it was five minutes yeah. beforehand and it soaks and otherwise it takes forever. But leaving the stove on, that's Yikes. just me with no sleep. You messed up. Whoopsie yeah. daisy. You left the stove on at the studio? I never do that. Well, it sounds like you do. Christian, I, you could have ruined my hand modeling career. Think about that for a second. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, think about it. You got wonderful hands. It I'm started sorry. with the, yeah. uh, forgetting to scramble them before you. So there was something There was something going on yeah. in my head today. Yeah, I didn't scram- I just threw, threw them in the pan. So I left Put them in a bowl See, I to think, just toss them I, in. I think this was a hit job. I think that, uh, no. Yeah. no, I think Wendy's framing me here. I don't think this is true. No, I believe her. Hey, Wendy, I have a question for you. Are you a flat earther? Go for it. Are you a flat Am earther? Am I what? Are you a flat earther? Do you, do, you, no. do you think? <laughs> awesome. All right. Well, thank you, Wendy, and I'm sorry that I almost killed you. Oh, okay. I appreciate it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Cool. What time is it? I'm just not uh, comfortable. Five like, till. I'm not comfortable ma- or cooking food in an office setting. I, I, I just doesn't. I do little, it. I do it for you guys. Yeah, I told you that. I do it for you guys. If I because if I, hunger monster. I get out of here, I get out of my house in, yeah. in the morning. You can't and I have to rush out. It's impossible for you to do it in the comfort of your own home. It, well, I eat I eat a bowl of oatmeal before I leave, but yeah. that doesn't do it. I gotta grab I grab myself four eggs and I and I make them. If yeah. you do it for us, then you would be actually making us eggs too. Hmm. No, yeah. you should cook eggs for yeah, us. You don't understand. You know, you've been around long you enough. You haven't met the hunger monster. Yeah, you've been around long enough. Um, anyway, it's like a muppet except less furry and more of a dick. Yeah, <laughs> so true. Yeah, I can't deny any of that. <laughs> he literally, he literally like quit schmoes nine different times. I was like, what the fuck's wrong with you? It's like, like, what's it's wrong com- with you? He's like, I'm sorry, man, I haven't eaten today. Com- Comic Con. Yeah. It was the Comic Con trip. Yeah, we were going over there, nine. and like, and no, like there was a hiccup with like getting. The, I don't remember uh, what it was. Getting the, 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 the we had a road mic, and we were just mounting it oh, to the right. camera, and I'm like mounting, it. I'm like, yeah, I'm just gonna need like a rubber band to do it. He's like, it's done, it's over. It's over. Turn the car around. Like, you need to go to Ralph's they look, or something? They looked at me like, who is this? <laughs> it was just like, gave up. I had, that was the first the time Dasani I ex- monster. Well, it was the first time I had to explain like what it was. And, just, and Ellis's it's face, I'll never forget. Sappy it. Dad. I'll, like, never, I'll is... never forget Ellis's face. Ellis looked at me like <laughs> Mongo hungry. <laughs> <laughs> really what it was. It really what it was. It's like, uh, so, I, I don't, so that's why I make sure I eat here every morning. And so, but I almost killed Wendy in the process. So I apologize. <laughs> oh. Pour some Dasani on her hand. Price that's to pay for some eggs. That's well, it. That's, that's it. it. Uh, do you guys you think done. we're all going to be friends next year? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's the movie? You never know. Oh man. What breakfast club? Stand by me. Oh no, I don't know. I just oh. think it's funny to say that. Oh, okay. It's like I don't know. The breakfast well, club's we'll a good, see. good. That was a oh, good. Oh, that's what it was. Yeah, it's yeah. Breakfast club. Yeah. I mean, we're all going to college. Dorina's going to state. Yeah. You're going to tech. True. All right. Well, good. That's good. <laughs> good stuff. All right. Let's let's <laughs> nice move on right on out one. of the studio, guys. Thank you so much for joining us today. Oh, there you go. I was waiting for it. <laughs> Good show this week, and I appreciate everybody tuning in here. Make sure that you go to Collider Live on the Apple Podcast or Spotify and download it. Keep getting those numbers up there. We're getting up in the charts. Go to the podcast channel for Collider if you want to see some of these clip outs. Apparently, the Van Damme clips are like 150,000 now. As I love it that. should be. As it should be. He might be a flat earther. Go get some of those tickets. <laughs> get Ellis' Rel- mm-hmm. comedy show. Go to Mark Ellis Live. And make sure you get those Schmodown tickets if you're in Chicago. If you are coming to the free for all, do it. Let the English see you do it. Braveheart, 1995. See you on Monday. <laughs>